Sue Daly, she brought me down to the Bayfront Center when I was real little. And then I heard about the school. And I signed up and came here. And my sixth and seventh grade I spent with normal social studies, English, science and math class. And then uh, I had a boat shop class. It looks like these kids are building a San Francisco Pelican, but really this Pelican is building these students. They're learning teamwork, they're learning to think on their feet, they're learning to uh, problem solve. Uh, this is a sort of a simple boat they're building. It's number 85 from this shop. The boat behind there, the Erie boat, pretty significant piece of Erie's history. That also was built by Erie students. Over a thousand kids worked on that boat and have sailed on it for the past eight years. It's, uh, it's made a big impact on my life. Students that aren't traditional learners, that have trouble in a traditional classroom, there's other ways to approach education with these kids and hands-on learning, project-based learning. You were point oh, this oh, right oh, here. close. I mean, the kids trim the sails, they hoist the sails. Pull real hard, yeah, pull real hard. I'll help you out. You know why we started this program? So kids could get out on boats? Learned how to be a great sailor. I've learned how to predict things. Any feel, feel, the shark bite feel on the bow. Icebergs, mermaids, walruses, we don't want to hit anything. This is Taco. This is a 34-foot racing catamaran. We use it as a teaching platform because it's a big boat and we can take out a lot of kids. And the ancient Polynesians came up with this design. So who's the Polynesians? Who knows? Anybody ever hear of Hawaii or Tahiti? How about Tonga and Samoa? This is 20% of the fresh water available for all the people on the whole planet on the Earth. It helps them, helps them get along with their friends, helps them get along with other people. This place is about building boats with kids, teaching kids leadership. You can't talk your way out of trouble on a sailboat. There's things that you have to do. Pointed right yeah. straight at it. There's an immediacy to this. There's no reset button. There's no, uh, it either works or doesn't. Hang on, we're hitting some waves. If we were going 10 knots, we'd be going about 11 or 12 miles an hour. The kids nowadays, I mean, they, they like to play a lot of video games. And this is more awesomer than playing video games. Get some out in the open, some fresh air. Oh, we bust that way video. Even people that have come from, from a troubled house or, or, or whatever, whatever their problem is, sailing is, sailing helps. It's, a, it's just a great escape for everyone. We've seen miracles. We've seen miracles in, with these kids. Whoa! We had one young woman, and she was an alt-ed program, who was pretty much given up on. Other kids were out sailing and doing stuff and she was just in the shop, focused and working hard. Whenever you go sailing, you forget about any problems we had that day. What he said was, his sailing is the best ever. The Bayfront School is amazing. I love this place. What people don't realize is 70% of our funding comes directly from our programming. We don't receive money from the state or, or the city funding. This is very important work and we depend on the community and need the community's support to help us continue working with these kids. It had a big impact on my life and uh, sent me in the right direction.